You've seen him on Comedy Next Gen. Please welcome Simon Taylor. Comedy at play, this is the best. This is a fun job to have. I didn't always do this, I was actually a plasterer. For two days and, oh, so brutal. I just couldn't handle work. They would ask me to do things and I couldn't handle it. They'd be like, Simon, can you hang that plasterboard? I'd be like, oh, I might just do a Bachelor of Arts. <laughs> There's a progressive Melbourne crowd. It's nice to be here in Melbourne. We've got a very progressive young crowd. You guys know, you guys know, that you can be gay and you can be a vegetarian, but you don't have to be both. <laughs> you don't, there's no legislation. See, the plasterers I worked with, they didn't know that. They'd say things to me like, what are you eating, Simon? I'll be like, ah, uh, this is tofu. What are you, a faggot? <laughs> I said, I don't think that's how it works, mate. <laughs> I don't think young boys are coming out of their bedroom like, mum, dad, I'm gay. Oh, but we just cooked a roast. <laughs> Where are you going to get your protein from? <laughs> Don't answer that. <laughs> See, I want to be masculine, I don't want to be limited, you know what I mean? Like, I only realised this year, even though I'm a straight man, I can go to gay nightclubs. <laughs> They're amazing. Here's the thing, right? If you're a straight fella and you've never been to a gay nightclub, go, get into it. So, don't limit yourself, right? This is what you do. You get two or three lady friends. They're going to love it because they're not going to be hit on by creepy dudes. And you're going to love it, fellas, because you're no longer limited to straight man dance moves. <laughs> we all know those dance moves. Step, step, hold a beer. Step, step, hold a beer. <laughs> Pez dispenser neck. <laughs> That's all we usually get, fellas. Not in a gay nightclub, I felt free. I could shimmy into the dance floor, yes. I could do the Christina Aguilera drop, one of these. Mm. <laughs> now, listen, if you go to a gay nightclub, fellas, you may get hit on by guys, and that's fair enough, that's the territory. But if you're not interested, all right, there's a couple of steps. If you're there in the gay nightclub, dancing with your lady friends, and a fella comes up to you, and he's like, oh, g'day, mate. He starts grinding up on you, and you're like, oh, I don't know. He's like, no, come on, man, scrap your brain. He's like, no, I'm not sure. He's like, no, come on, dude, just give us a little kick. You're like, no, I don't, I don't know. And he's like, no, he's like, no, I'm not sure. Like, no, come on, man. Like, no, I just want to dance with my friends. <laughs> that happens, fellas. The guy's hitting on you, and you're not interested. Step one is you realise that's what women always put up with, and you get over yourself. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, I'm uncomfortable. Welcome to clubbing for most people. That's, that's how it is. That's cool. Step number two, right? It's just relax. This is why you bring your lady friends, right? You give them the universal signal. Ladies will know this one. <laughs> they grab your hand, they pull you over, they create a barrier around you. They creep the, keep the creepos out and you know what works because they've been doing it to you your entire clubbing life. <laughs> So here's the thing, right? I went to a gay nightclub in, in Brisbane with my friend Ashley and Sarah. And uh, I was on the dance floor and I, I hadn't, I'd never been before. I was like, this is incredible. I didn't know how much I like Cher. This is so fun. There's <laughs> foam coming from the roof. This is the best. I love this, right? And then this dude came in. He was wearing sort of like a black V-neck. He started hitting on my friend Ashley and she didn't, you know, she didn't want that, she moved away and he kept trying. And I thought, this is, don't come to a gay nightclub to hit on women, this is not on. So I thought from one straight dude to another, I should have a word with him. So I puffed my chest out, put my chin up. I went up to him and I said, mm, excuse me, <laughs> Ashley is clearly not into you and with that V-neck, I don't know who will be. Boom, oh, I've never felt so masculine in my life. My name is Simon Tell, you guys are awesome. Have a good night. Bye.